Hi everyone, Mikey 79 here and welcome to this new video of Magic Duels and this is round 3 of the Xbox One Fight Club and I'm playing against DTGMCG or uh, DCGMTG, I, I can't remember <laughs> anyway, uh, the guy plays a Mardu Vehicles uh, build and yeah, usually they go a bit fast so I'm gonna have a rough time um, it will also depend on how fast that I can find my reclamation sage, I guess, and how good I can hold him back. He also plays a bunch of flyers and kind of a lot of removal. Now this is a okay hand, I guess, so let's keep it. Um, although I like the green, it's a bit risky. It's a bit risky. I'm gonna redraw one hand. Yeah, this one I guess I'll keep, although it's very slow. But I don't want to go down to uh, to six cards, so we'll see what it does. Okay, let's play the Lumbering Falls. So yeah, he plays uh, right down as well. Um, and there's uh, already a uh, Heart of Kirin, which is going to give me some trouble. No, I do have a woodland below her, but that's gonna take a while before I can play that. So, uh, yeah. I think this hand will be too slow. So, Heart of Kieran, I think it's Crew 3, yeah. Yeah, and he can crew it already, so he's going pretty fast here. So yeah, vehicles in general, they give me a hard time. Uh, I win from them as well, it's not that I'm defenseless against them, but it is difficult. And of course I knew in this tournament that there will be a lot of vehicles deck and it shows they are. Uh, uh, but yeah, I always want to do my thing. Uh, I, I don't like to build also a vehicles deck. I know they perform the best of all, but I think there are enough of them already. Uh, yeah, and I think it's good to have some diversity in a tournament. Now, I hope I draw a land uh, in the near future here. So yeah, he's going pretty fast here. He's got three creatures already. If I get up to five, then pff, even then uh, it's going to be difficult. Uh, let's see here. Do I block a 2-2? Two -two? Yeah, why not? Because I can, uh... Guess it's better to uh, take as little damage as I can. Well, that's not gonna help me much right now. So let's just play the familiar. I'm also a little bit in land trouble here. think that this game will be it <laughs> that's for sure now I didn't expect to win this one anyway uh, like I said I I prefer to have a good time in tournaments and yeah I really dislike the vehicles deck like I said before so playing them for me wasn't an option to begin with uh, I could have gone for another control build like I usually do with heavy removal and everything but then again, then I would be doing the same thing again like I always do. And now last round, in round 2, I was a bit disgusted because yeah, there I had the feeling that I could have won. And yeah, that's a, a bit of a shame uh, that I let that game go. Uh, slip, let, it, let it slip away through my fingers. But anyway, too late for that now. Uh, 
So yeah, we're taking six damage here. And if I would just get some land drops, but they're not coming, so I guess I will have to play. So Hilly doesn't do much either. Could go for the two life gain. Then I'm at nine. Then I'm at nine. Could also imprison in the moon is lupine. It's prototype. But yeah, I'm a bit. Yeah, I'm definitely screwed here. Doesn't happen much with this deck, but it, yeah, as you can see, it does happen. So, do I go for the life gain by copying this? And then maybe he's going to. Well, he's gonna go phase anyway, so. Pfft, it's a difficult choice. Or do I go for the land? Okay, let's see. How much mana does he have? One, two, three, four, five. So we can. I'll just imprisoning the moon the lupine. Or her. It's probably better her. He doesn't play planeswalkers, so shouldn't be concerned about those. Now at least he can buff up uh, the Kieran, but it's gonna be all over. I guess. If he can ditch his hand, it's definitely over. And I still don't draw any lands, Jesus. Uh, this one, uh, by the time I can play that... Uh, yeah, and he's just going to activate the land, so... Yeah, it's it's already over. So yeah, that was pretty fast. I saw some videos of him playing and sometimes he doesn't even play a vehicle at all. So I guess I'm unlucky that he has the heart of Kieran in his opening hand. But yeah, it is what it is. It's difficult to deal with. And yeah, that was pretty a pretty good game for him. I think he had a great opening hand. So on to the next one. Okay guys, let's see if we can see, well, well, I'm losing my words here, let's see if we can at least win a one round, uh, maybe we'll keep a, a lesser hand because he has a one round already, and let's hope I get some great hand here, if I get a reclamation sage already in my opening hand that would be great, and let's hope that I don't get screwed again, that was a bit annoying, I built the deck a bit around it that that wouldn't happen, but yeah. Normally I draw enough cards uh, so that something like that would not happen. Now, I guess it won't happen now. Is it a good hand? Eh, it's not really good, but uh, it's an early hand. At least I can play my stuff. So let's, and I'm on the play as well. So let's start with a Evolving Wilds. I should probably go searching for a red, but it depends on what he does. Um, screw it, I'm going for green. way I can uh, keep up the tempo a bit. Another heart of Kieran. Well, he's lucky. Is that card gonna cost me two rounds in a row? Could be. 
Okay, let's play the Wandering Falls. Play this one. Prison in the moon. Alright. Next turn I could go Imprison in the Moon, Elvish Visionary or only Rogue Refiner, depending on what he plays. It's not gonna do much here. So I guess I'll first play this. Maybe I draw a Rex Age. Bit wishful thinking, but you'll never know. No, an Omnet, so let's play this one. So yeah, maybe I should have gone with uh, the Chandra uh, way, but I with the evolving wild searching for a red, but yeah, wouldn't st I would still wouldn't have my double red, so it would still be a problem. Now the Westvale Abbey, mm, yeah, maybe if I can uh, make him flip the Westvale, then uh, he's in a pickle. But yeah, I still like the five mana as well. Still need a land. I guess if I can find that one, he's in trouble. Like I said, he plays removal, so... There's another... Uh, this just goes too fast. And he finds all the vehicles, of course, so... Yeah, that's, that's a problem. It's a real pain. Still screwed again. Unbelievable. This has never happened to me before. Can't can't believe it. <laughs> so yeah, I guess I might as well swing. Yeah, that's three extra damage. He's going to activate that one and the other one. And I guess that makes seven. Yeah, that's it. That's all she wrote. So it's already over here. Yeah, too fast. Didn't find any lands either. Uh, I guess maybe... Yeah, I don't know. Maybe if I found some land earlier in the game, it would have been better. But as you can see, this is a really difficult matchup for me. Um, yeah, like I said, I don't think I, I did anything wrong here or anything. It's just, yeah. Uh, the build lacks removal for decks like this that go super fast. Maybe I expected some more control in uh, the tournament as well. But there are a lot of vehicle decks, so this isn't the one, the only one that's going to give me a problem. So anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, it's a short one, at least it's a short pain. Uh, I'm more in peace with this loss than I was with the previous one. So still think that I should have won the previous game. 
but uh, yeah, it is what it is. Anyway, hope to see you guys next time. Bye bye guys, have a nice day.